Imagine a computer so powerful that it can perform one quintillion calculations per second. In case you're wondering, that's one with 18 zeros after it. A computer that can process more data than the entire human population combined. That's about 8 billion people. A computer that can create a digital duplicate of the human visual cortex and brain function and use it to drive a car autonomously. This is not science fiction. This is Dojo. Tesla's new supercomputer. Stay until the end of the video to find out what this all means for the future of AI and humanity. Tesla is not just a car company, it is also an AI company that's developing its own fully self-driving system based on computer vision. Computer vision is the ability of machines to see and understand the world through images and videos. To achieve this ambitious goal, Tesla needs a massive amount of computing power to train its neural networks with real-world data from millions of cameras on its vehicles. Neural networks are mathematical models that mimic the structure and function of biological brains. They learn from data by adjusting their parameters to minimize errors and maximize accuracy. Training neural networks is like teaching a child how to do something, except that you need a lot more data and patience. That's why Tesla has built Dojo, a supercomputer that is designed from the ground up to train AI. But what is Dojo going to do? Why does Tesla need such a ridiculously powerful computer? The answer is simple, to train its fully self-driving neural network. This network is intended to help autopilot computers in Tesla cars to understand roads and drive safely without human intervention. To do this, the network needs to learn from vast amounts of video data captured by the vehicle's camera in real-life driving situations. The video data needs to be labeled or tagged with information such as objects, depth, velocity, and actions. This process helps the network recognize patterns and make associations. For example, if the network sees a red octagonal sign with white letters that say stop, it needs to know that it means stop and act accordingly. Dojo is different from conventional supercomputers in many ways. It uses a system on the chip architecture, which means that each chip contains all of the components of a complete computer, such as memory, processing, and communication. These chips are all then fused into tiles, which are then integrated into racks, cabinets, and clusters. This allows for a high level of efficiency, scalability, and performance. Dojo is also different from other AI training systems. It does not use any GPUs or graphics processing units, which are commonly used for this purpose. GPUs are specialized chips that are good at performing parallel computations, such as rendering graphics or processing images. However, typical GPUs are not optimized for computer vision processing and recognition, which require more sequential and complex computations. Instead, Dojo uses its custom chips that are optimized for computer vision video processing and recognition. These chips can handle large amounts of data with minimal power or calling requirements. They also have a unique feature called programmable float point precision, which allows them to adjust the level of accuracy and speed of their calculations depending on the task. According to Tesla, Dojo went into production in July 2023 and is expected to reach over 30 exaflops of computing by February 2024, making it one of the world's five most powerful superchips. By October 2024, Tesla plans to increase its computing power to 100 exaflops, which is equivalent to 300,000 NVIDIA A100 GPUs, the industry standard for AI training. To put this into perspective, 100 exaflops is more than twice the combined computing power of the top 500 supercomputers in the world. It is also more than 10 times the estimated computer power of the human brain, and more than enough to run many cyberpunks on ultra settings. In the past, Tesla has used humans to do this labeling job, but it is not sustainable as the dataset grows larger and more complex. That's why Tesla needs Dojo to automate this process and speed up the training cycle. Dojo can label video data faster and more accurately than humans, using advanced techniques such as self-supervised learning, active learning, and transfer learning. Self-supervised learning is a method of learning from unlabeled data by generating labels from the data itself. For example, Dojo can use the temporal coherence of video frames to infer the motion and depth of objects. Active learning is a method of selecting the most informative data samples for labeling based on the uncertainty or difficulty of the model. For example, Dojo can prioritize labeling data that contains rare or ambiguous situations, such as snow or construction zones. Transfer learning is a method of applying the knowledge learned from one domain to another domain. 
For example, Dojo can use the knowledge learned from driving in the US to driving in other countries with some adaptations. With Dojo, Tesla hopes to create a feedback loop between its vehicles and its data center. The cars will send their video data to Dojo for training and improvement. Dojo will then send back updated neural network models to the vehicles for testing and validation. This way, Tesla can continuously improve its self-driving system with real-world data and experience. But that's not all. Dojo is also a part of Tesla's bigger vision for artificial intelligence. Tesla plans to use it not only for its self-driving cars, but also for its humanoid robots, which it announced at its AI Day event in 2022. These robots are designed to perform tasks that are boring, repetitive, or dangerous for humans. To make these robots intelligent and capable, Tesla will use the same neural network architecture that it uses for its self-driving cars. That means that Dojo will also train these robots with video data from their cameras and sensors. By doing this, Tesla hopes to generate a general purpose AI system that can handle a variety of tasks and scenarios. However, Dojo is not only a tool for Tesla's products, it's also a potential source of income for Tesla, as it can offer its computing power to other companies and researchers who need AI training services. This is similar to how AWS, Amazon Web Services, rents out its cloud computing infrastructure to millions of customers, generating billions of dollars in revenue and profit for Amazon. AWS is the market leader in cloud computing, with a 32% market share in 2021, followed by Microsoft Azure with 20% and Google Cloud with 9%. AWS offers a range of services such as storage, networking, databases, analytics, machine learning, and more. AWS has millions of customers across various industries, such as Netflix, Airbnb, NASA, Pfizer, and more. Tesla could leverage its Dojo supercomputer to create a similar business model, but focus focused on AI training. They can charge customers based on the amount of data they want to process, the complexity of their models, and the speed of their results. Tesla can target customers who need high-performance AI training for computer vision, neural language processing, or other domains. It can partner with other companies or institutions that have complementary datasets or expertise, such as OpenAI, Neuralink, or SpaceX. By doing this, Tesla will create a new revenue stream that would diversify its income sources and reduce its dependencies on vehicle sales. It could also benefit from the network effects and economies of scale that come from having a large customer base and a powerful computing platform. An example of how Dojo could help grow Elon Musk's business is by providing AI training services to Neuralink, another company founded by Musk, that aims to create brain-computer interfaces. Neuralink needs to train its neural network to decode neural signals from implanted electrodes and translate them into commands for computers or devices. This requires a lot of computing power and data processing. Neuralink could also use its supercomputer to speed up its training process and improve its accuracy. It could also share data with Tesla, which could use it to enhance its self-driving cars or humanoid robots. Another example of how Dojo could help grow Elon Musk's business is by providing AI training services to SpaceX. The company needs to train its neural networks to control its rockets, satellites, and starships. This requires a lot of computing power and data processing. SpaceX could use it to speed up its training process and improve its reliability. But what does this mean for the future of AI and humanity? Will Dojo enable Tesla to create super intelligent machines that can surpass human abilities? Will these machines be friendly or hostile to humans? Will Tesla share its Dojo computing power with other researchers and developers who want to advance AI for good? These are some of the questions that arise as Tesla unveils its new insane supercomputer that takes the industry by storm. Elon Musk has been vocal about his views on AI and its potential risks and benefits for humanity. He has warned that AI could pose an existential threat to humans if it becomes smarter and more powerful than us. He has advocated for the regulation and ethical use of AI to ensure its alignment with human values and interests. With Dojo, Tesla aims to create a friendly and beneficial AI system that can help humans achieve their goals and aspirations. Tesla's mission is to accelerate the world's transition to sustainable energy and transport and to make life more fun and exciting. Tesla's products are designed to be safe, reliable, and enjoyable for humans, whether they are cars, robots, or anything else. Watch these videos as well. Hit that subscribe button, like, and drop a comment below to let us know your thoughts.